I have a visitor. I'm sure the semi trucks can go out of its way to startle it away, though. What's up, little lady deer? I think that's a doe. I think it's a young lady munching on some berries or something. So what's up, guys? I'm just sitting here uh, looking at homes, trying to find, figure out what I'm going to do in regards to uh, to where I'm going to move. If I'm going to move, my brother's moving out July 1st. Uh, this is the first clip of the week, I think, actually. My brother's moving out July 1st. Uh, I have to have a car by, by well, about July 1st or soon after that uh and i don't know you know i have a lot of things on my plate right now you guys it's really frustrating it's just like i feel a little overwhelmed uh yeah well first things first i need to think about the car and once I get the car and the license within the next three weeks, I need to think about where I'm going to move to or if I'm going to stay where I'm at. I like the idea. I've been considering getting my own place, like rent to own a home. Because if I'm going to pay rent every month, why not pay rent to own it instead of just rent for to reside in it, you know? I don't know, though. I don't know. Life is a little stressful for me at the moment. I wonder where these guys stay. I mean, that's not a very big foresty area back there. Uh, it's it's not even, it's really small. You can, within like five minutes, I could walk across it. If that, you know, it's more like two minutes I could walk across it because it's, it's really that small. Like in the s winter, you can see the uh, business that's on the other side of this through the trees easily. What do, you, what do you see over there? You hear something, buddy? I think I'll scare it off. I was to try and open the window. Anyways, where's my gun when I need it? Just kidding. I wouldn't do that. Just, uh, this is a prime example of, of urban life being taken over by oh well, there she goes later lady that i bet that means there's a truck on its way is there a truck on the way oh yeah there was the security guard scaring it off there he goes jerk oh you scared my deer away because he was too lazy to do his rounds by walking Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. See you on the next Clipsy. It's a weirdo, aren't you? Do you think you're a dog? Been spending a little too much time around Titan? Huh? Did he teach you some dog habits there? Hershey. You gonna answer me? Probably not. Oh, okay. Uh well, at least you provided me another clip to, for the week. I didn't really have much to provide yet this week. Look at my dirty sock over there. It's giving me the vlog. The floor is dirty in general, isn't it? Might as well guess I won't hide it. Uh, Hershey. Come say hello to us. What's up, kitty cat? I was actually getting ready to put the socks on. <laughs> What's up, little lady? Yeah, you don't want to play. You just want some neck scratches. All right, well, you know what? I got to get ready for work. So, peace out, people. What's up, my friends? Hello again. Welcome to another clip. This is actually 
going to be the final clip of the week because uh, it's technically Monday morning. Uh, I was avoiding this clip all night long. <laughs> I got more frustrating news that I'm having to deal with, so <clears throat> let's go ahead and journal it or vlog it or whatever you want to call it. It's about 5 a.m. just about. Uh, I'm just sitting here, like I've been doing all night, thinking. I haven't played any games or watched any shows since since the beginning of Shift. I watched a couple videos at the very beginning of the Shift. Like, maybe 30 minutes worth, and that was it. If that. Uh, so I've sat 12 hours just thinking and trying to solve my problems or psych myself out into being relaxed about them. I got relaxed for a while. But, uh, so yesterday, all right, so as we know, we've established, I have to get a car, like, as soon as possible. I've got less than two weeks left before I have to have a car. Uh, so I was like, all right, man, this, this is tough timing here, man. But, uh, I'm starting to save, okay? Uh, well, I, I have some saved, is what I'm saying. Now, I'm like, alright, alright, I'll do that. My concern was whether or not I'm going to get a license before that time, not whether I'm going to get a car, because I believe I'll end up having a way to get a car no matter what. But, nobody has let me do any practice driving just about whatsoever. But I keep getting told by everyone that I need to do practice driving. And I'm like, well, I feel like I'm being set up for failure. I feel like I'm being asked to do calculus without ever learning pre-algebra. Uh, that's just how I feel about that. But I'm managing that. I'm managing the fact that my families are all my family's all moving into their own little places and doing their own little thing now and kind of leaving me behind, you know. Uh, I'm managing that. Then I get told that uh, I can keep the house that I'm currently at, you know, the place that I've been living at, uh, that we'd be able to keep staying there, me and David. And I'm like, all right, cool, I'll, I'll consider about whether we want to move in a few months. And then yesterday I get told on my way to work that I have to move out of there by August. And I get just really upset, man. I'm just, I'm like, dude, you're just, you're overwhelming me. You're throwing, it so, you, the, you know, my brother says, oh, I've been telling you guys that we were all going to move for months, you know, and he's not wrong. He has, but what he's been saying is, it's very flip-floppy. Like he'd say, all right, uh, like last year he says, in February, you guys, I'm moving, and so, uh, and that was like in November that he said that, okay? So then, um, me and David were like, okay, okay, we'll save, we're gonna move. Uh, we'll get a place where we can share rent. Uh, and, uh, and it's always cheaper when you have a roommate, you know? Uh... Otherwise, I would just definitely have a place on my own, which I've considered. But, but then my brother, well, when February came around, changed his mind and said, no, we're not going to move until I'm finished working on the truck, which will probably be beginning of the year, of next year. And I'm like, okay. But he's done that a lot of times, where he's flip-flopped on whether we're moving or not moving. We're moving, we're not moving. He doesn't see it that way. He just sees it as him telling us that he... That, all along that we were going to move. Uh, so I guess that's my fault. But now I'm being told I have less than a month to save up enough money to move into another house. And I have to save up money to move into another house and save up money to get a car and save up money to buy, pay all my bills next month. <sighs> Granted, the rent isn't going to exit be there. It's just going to be 
electric and other bills like that I have to pay. But I still have my phone bill and uh, if I have a car, whatever payments I have to make on the car. I have, I just feel really overwhelmed. And I don't know if it's all going to work out. I mean, I, I'm trying to tell myself, yeah, it's all going to be good. Everything will be fine, but I honestly am not sure if it will or not. So I'm, I guess I'm just making this journal to document, see what the future holds for me, you know? Hopefully, I'm, hopefully it'll all be cool and it won't be a big deal. You know, let's try and get the camera to focus. There we go. So, I'm going through a lot right now, you know, and I'm really worried, but I'm also curious to see what's all going to happen. I don't know. I really do not know, friends. I have to make sure I get a place that I can do right by Titan. And, because he's my buddy. He's my responsibility, man. And Titan, he, you know, I'm not going to get rid of him. I'll pay more if I have to to live somewhere else in order to keep, uh, keep him and take care of him. But I'm just going to try and make it through this one, one problem at a time. Like this week, I'm going to try and get my license. And then after I get the license, I'll move to the next step. But hopefully I can get that license this week. Because uh, it'll get harder and harder the longer I go. The closer it gets to that time. One step at a time, you guys. One step at a time. Anyways, thanks for watching this vlog. Uh, hope to see you guys on the next clip. I've been thinking about renaming the channel again to something like Josh's Journal of Life or something like that because <laughs> it's not really blue phoenix entertainment there's really nothing in correlation to that so i mean i'm not an enterprise so <laughs> i'll talk to you guys later peace out see you next week later stay awesome